Hey guys, for today's video, I have a new body lotion. So this is the Summer Friday Summer Skin Nourishing Body Lotion. It's 35 Canadian or 26 US dollars. And in this tube, you get 200 mils or 6.7 fluid ounces. It's a pretty standard amount for a body lotion sold at Sephora. So I'm a sucker for packaging and this looks great on my vanity. I love a nice, plain, simple packaging. Plus the tube is really convenient for a body lotion. I much rather prefer a tube over a tub. I'd say for me, it goes tube and then pump and then tub. <laughs> Cause with a tube, you can just align your whole entire body with it and then rub it in. I love it. Yeah, it looks very nice on display. I keep it in my bathroom and it's a good accessory. So the lotion itself is white. I'll just show you here on my hand. The consistency, it's like a medium thickness. If you know the First Aid Beauty Ultra Pear Cream, it's less thick than that. It's kind of more gel-like. It's not a gel lotion, but just with the texture, it's like that medium. It's not runny, it's not too light, it's not too thick, it's right in the middle. The scent of this product has been quite the debate. So it's supposed to smell like coconut, vanilla, and almonds. So like a really summertime tropical scent, that's kind of what I envision when I think of those things combined. I don't smell really any of that. To me and to a lot of other people as well, it smells like Play-Doh when I'm rubbing it in and for a few minutes afterwards, totally it smells like Play-Doh. Definitely not coconut, definitely not vanilla, maybe a little bit of almond afterwards. It's like an after kind of scent, um, but like 99% Play-Doh. It's not like overpowering. It doesn't really bother me, but it is, it's there. Throughout the day though, I don't smell like Play-Doh, like it doesn't last very long. The whole scent is just not what I imagine when I think of like summer skin. I think of like tropical and this is kind of underwhelming for sure. So if you're gonna buy this because you think you like the sound of the scent, I would maybe smell it in store first before you go and purchase it because a lot of people, myself included, just smell Play-Doh. <laughs> Lots of people do love the scent, so maybe it's just a personal preference kind of thing. I don't know, to me, it's Play-Doh. I don't find it to be very strong or overpowering, but I've never been one to be sensitive to scented products. So, so just keep that in mind. As I'm applying it though, it sinks into my skin so beautifully. It absorbs quickly. It doesn't leave my skin feeling greasy. There's nothing I hate more than lotioning up my body and then going to get dressed or something and putting your clothes on and you just feel wet underneath, like damp greasy and you feel like you can't sit on things because you're greasy, this is totally the opposite of that. It sinks right in, leaves your skin feeling really soft, like velvety almost, it's awesome. For comfort, I give it a 10 out of 10. It's really, you can't beat it. I instantly feel comfortable, hydrated and like plumped up, get all the moisture back in there, you know? It's been really great on my feet too. Totally repaired all my dry skin. And then if I apply it and kind of leave it for a few days, like two, three days, my skin still feels like velvety smooth. The results are long lasting. Lots of body lotions that I've tried before, if you apply it and then have a shower or even just wait like a day, it's as if you didn't apply anything at all. But with this one, it's like my skin feels hydrated for days and days and days and it's awesome. I'm constantly applying this body lotion just because I want to and not because I feel like I have to. So to sum it up, the scent is honestly garbage and not even because it's a terrible scent to me, but just because I had high hopes for it, like coconut, vanilla, almond, sounds like it'd be a dream team of tropical summer goodness, but I am just left upset. Zero out of 10%, or maybe one out of 10 because it does have a scent, so that's a point. However, what is lacking in the scent is made up in comfort and lasting hydration results. I'm still gonna keep using it just because it makes my skin feel so good and it's so comfortable. So I think that pretty much sums it up. I've also been trying out the new Glow Recipe body lotion. So if you wanna hear my thoughts on that, make sure to subscribe, that'll be my next video. Um, other than that, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you later, bye.